Welcome back. I'm Charlie. Hi, and I'm Stu. So as you know, we've got three children, Oliver, Dexter and Amelia, and our exciting news is... If you don't already know... We're, we're moving, moving into, into the, the motorhome! Home. So we've kept you guys waiting long enough for our exciting news, so now that you know, um, yes, we are literally going to be living in the van. Uh, we've got some travel plans that we want to talk to you about, where we're thinking of going. So originally we sold our house back in December and it was very close to finishing and fortunately it fell through. So it's put a bit of a delay on our plans, um, but it has now sold again, although we've still got to go through the process. So originally I think we were heading straight for Europe, we were gone. Um, this time we've decided we're going to stay local, we're going to do UK for a bit. Obviously we've got bits to finalise with the house and then we will obviously end up in Europe. So that is the dream for us, isn't it? Yes, so we've been planning this now for about, oh, it's about three months in the planning. Yeah. Um, we understand that there's, as you can appreciate, a lot of things we've had to do. So yes, we've sold the house, um, sold a lot of our personal stuff and furniture. Cars. Yes. Um, given up jobs. Yeah. It's it's been a bit of a manic roller coaster already, actually. It's been three months. We, we haven't even set off we yet. We haven't even started to be yet. No. Um but first things first, we wanted to get this news out to you. Um and yeah, really just get you guys on board. You know, thank you to those of you who've been following our YouTube channel since we started. We really appreciate your support. And hello to all the new subscribers. We've had a lot of new subscribers over the last four weeks, so welcome. Um, Hopefully you uh, have a good giggle at our expense as we <laughs> yeah. uh, manoeuvre our lives through motorhoming. <laughs> yeah, so I think the first thing we'll talk about is the kids um, and obviously school, that's going to be the big question. Um, so obviously we're going to be homeschooling the children, um, this is going to be done over tutoring from me and Charles. The man but's pretty good at maths and I'm not bad at biology so they're alright, they're alright. <laughs> yeah. We'll get a tutor in for the rest. Yeah um, so they're going to be doing some online tutoring as well. We've spoken to both our local council and their school and we have their full support. Um, yeah. And we do actually intend in the future to get them back into mainstream school so you know we could do this for three months and absolutely hate it and realize we are part-timers after all so if we haven't strangled each other after three <laughs> months is it <laughs> on the other hand we could literally have the best time and i just think it's now or never for us just before yeah. the oldest goes to comp 100 percent. so yeah oliver is due to go to high school september 2023 yeah. so ideally the latest for us we'd like to come back would be then and obviously if we're having an absolute blast and there's you know the online children and all that is working we don't want to take that experience away from them or hold them back uh, so we're going to play that by year i think in yeah. our heads at the moment we know the latest we can come back is 2023 in september yeah. we, just, we could be back after a few weeks but yeah. we've got about a year um to enjoy fully embrace ourselves into full-time van life and travel the places we want to travel and give those children a really well-rounded experience that's it so we're leaving in two and a half weeks time our start of our travels is going to be the nec um we're going there right at the start um going to do a t day or two there so and if then, you're around and you see us say hi yeah definitely come say hello and then um, we're heading north going to do the nc500 in scotland we're going obviously we went there in the summer Awesome, and we went there for Christmas, and we did a mini tour there and got to see some beautiful sights, met great people. Uh, but this time we're going to go right up to the Highlands. We're going to do the NC500. We've got a good few weeks to do yeah, it. Yeah, we've got the John O'Groats sign to get. <laughs> well, we've got the Lands End one in, so we've got to get the John O'Groats one yeah. in. So we're really looking forward to that. And then once we've sort of done that, we're gonna head back towards Wales because ideally by then the house should be nearing completion get that finalized and then we're going to go from there so from there we will either go straight into Europe um, or well, we might well, there's we might two ways you can go isn't there you can go um, into France via the Euro Tunnel which we yep. none of us have done yep. so that would be a really exciting thing for us to do um, and also I don't like ferries which is the other option isn't it it's a ferry, ferry ride to Spain. Spain yeah so we, we don't know what we're gonna do but we're playing it by ear a little bit we we're are. just gonna move in I think we need a couple of weeks to be settled before we make any big trip when we started our channel six months ago we started it for a bit of a giggle um, we were not expecting the amount of support um, that we've had and we just really would like to shout out to quite a few of you for the comments the constant support um, 
the subscriptions, the watching us, it's really, really given us the momentum to carry on. Um, and, you know, obviously we will continue with our YouTube journey, especially now being full time. Um, and I think some of the things that we'll be able to show you will just be completely amazing. Um, as you know, some we're quite off the cuff. We don't tend to rehearse stuff. It is what you see is what you get. <laughs> I might cut out the odd swear word. But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that going on, I can tell you. <laughs> but it is literally, this is who we are. We're normal people, both working in our own jobs. You know, we've taken a, made a big decision about our life. Um, you know, and it is something that we've become very, very, very passionate about. The people that we've met along the way at the shows, um, people we've ended up having, you know, meeting up with. We've just fully embraced the motorhome lifestyle and, you know, long may it continue. So content wise, we still, we roughly we one a week. Um, going forward, we, we're not too sure how that's going to go. We're still going to plan on doing our minimum of one a week, uh, which is every Sunday at five. But obviously, as we're in the van a lot more and traveling a lot more, then we may have a lot more videos to put out. But we're, again, we're going to play it by year. Yeah, we'll wait and see. We'll start checking out the comments and, you know, we'll just see. That's it. What do you want? Do you want one a week? Do you want a couple <laughs> a week? Do you want one a... No, I didn't have him one a day. No, absolutely not. <laughs> oh, God. But it's all good fun. It's all good fun. Yeah. Um, but well, that's what we'll do, isn't it? We'll continue to do it. We're looking forward to it, though, aren't we? Yeah. It's going to be... Don't give it. It's gonna have its challenges. Oh, it's not gosh. gonna be easy. We know we're not we're not we're not blind to the fact that it comes with its own set of challenges. You know you you've you've got you're under each other's feet all day long, and you, we've got beds to make and unmake, and we've got schooling to do. So it's not all gonna be you know flowers and petals. It's it's gonna be some challenging times ahead. I think. Well, it but will be. Yeah, especially if you keep forgetting the gas. Yeah, let's not do that no more. I'm done with, yeah, running out of gas. <laughs> it was going to come up, wasn't it? It was going <laughs> to. Anyway. Notice how I'm running out of gas. It's blue job. What's a blue job? It's blue job. That's, that's, that means my you are, job. You, are, you ask Andy and Tracy, they'll tell you. It's a blue job. Like empty and the Elson. That's a blue job as well. All right, okay. Basically, all the crap jobs are my jobs. So that's our exciting news. We've been dying to tell you guys for what feels like ages to tell you. But it's happening. We are there. Yeah, finally. A couple of weeks' time, we're off. Uh, in the meantime, if you've got any comments, please feel free to, to leave them below. We will respond to each and every one of you um, and hopefully be able to answer your question. We hope you join us along our our new journey. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> well, someone's got to do it. It might as well be us. Might as well be. But until next time, wherever we are, <laughs> we'll see you in a bit. You just nicked my line. <laughs> I nicked her line. See you in a bit. <laughs> Try, guys. <laughs>